Guinness and Gerberhardt or GAB's financial year 2015 results has come within expectations. Even so, the company remains cautious on its prospects given the volatile market sentiment. GAB's financial year 2015 results were largely contributed by its strong first three quarters. The group is also kicking off its first quarter 2016 ending September well. We had a really good start of, uh, of F16 um, and what we're, what we're hopeful of um, post-GST implementation um, we're seeing the business normalising actually a lot faster than what we imagined ourselves. So I think we're in a good space, um, but at the same time there's a lot of unpredictability in the market. GAB believes it is able to pull through all right in FI2016, but warns of unpredictable internal and external environment. Indication is that um, um, if we can continue the momentum that we had in F15, um, with the brands that we got, with uh, the systems, with the activation plans that we have, um, we feel that we're, gonna do, we're going to do well. Following GAB's fourth quarter results and recent sell-down in its share price, research houses today have upgraded the stock. Among them are CIMB, which has an ad call, and UOB has a buy call for GAB. GAB ended the day at 12 ringgit and 98 cent. Willin Tang, DHTV.